poodle look is not working for me today. Uh uh. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I have got a haul and try on video for you. Now, as we're coming into my favourite months ever, spring and summer, these are my favourite months as well for fashion and trends. You can probably expect to see quite a few more hauls and lookbook kind of videos coming from me over the next couple of months, but I thought I would start today with a kind of transitional one where I've picked up a few random items from Primark, New Look, River Island and Topshop. Now first up I picked up this really gorgeous cornflower blue pair of jeans from New Look. Now I have seen that there's been a fair few shades of this colour blue that have been out this current kind of season and they just really really caught my eye. Now I went into New Look and they had quite a vast range of them and they've got all of these different kind of pairs of jeans but with different names on them. These were the Halley pair and it is this really really beautiful as i said before cornflower blue kind of shade now i really wanted a pair without the slits in the knees i love that kind of look but for this kind of pair i just wanted ones that i could use pretty much wherever going out at work or even just casual at the weekends i really really like this style that's cut off at the bottom with this kind of fraying look it looks really really nice with a pair of heels or just with a pair of converse what really caught my eye as well about these ones was the stretchy material. They're not quite like a jegging and they're not quite like a stiff jean. They're kind of like in between. And these are high-waisted. I much prefer high-waisted jeans on myself. They're just a little bit more flattering. But yeah, what caught my eye the most was this colour blue. I do have ones that are fairly similar and in all fairness, I did actually go out looking for ones that were kind of like lighter shade. However, these ones just looked really, really great and I know that I'm going to get a hell of a lot of use out of them over the next couple of months. Now next up, you might have seen this outfit on one of my videos. I did like a outfit of the day kind of thing with my friend Nate. He was photographing, <laughs> photographing, photographing, photo, yeah. He was basically taking photos of me and we went out in the snow. We were going to get like a kind of lookbook kind of look but it just didn't really work out with it being so cold and the lights kept blowing over. So yeah but we did manage to get a few clear shots with this outfit and I just thought that while this is a haul and I picked this up recently I thought I would share it with you. So first up, I'm going to start off with this really, really gorgeous cream oatmeal rib funnel top. Now, it's very, very crop toppy, so it doesn't, it, if you're wearing like high-waisted trousers, then you're absolutely fine, but, um, and like a high-waisted kind of skirt, but anything other than that, then you're going to be showing your midriff. But it's just really, really nice. It's almost like a turtleneck, but kind of not. And I really just like this bat wing underneath the arms. It's kind of nice and loose and baggy. I love the colour. It's so very me. And it's also going to be so, so nice to wear in the spring and the summer. I know like this kind of, you would probably associate like a high neck with more autumny and winter but see i just felt like this is a really really good transitional piece and i'm going to show you the skirt that i paired it with and this is the skirt in question it's just this beautiful gray color skirt now i don't actually know the pattern of this what would you say that this pattern is called because i'm not quite sure i really really like the material of it it's really really nice and loose around the stomach it's quite high waisted and it's quite a nice thick material now i feel that this skirt is really really good for now and will definitely be transitioning into summer with a nice pair of boots and the top that i showed you a minute ago but i also feel that that would totally totally work come the autumn as well so i feel like i'm going to get a lot of use out of this as i said right in the beginning through the different seasons and once again i know that i'm just going to get a lot of use out of it so next up i picked up two items from river island first of all i picked up this really really beautiful blush colored dress now i have to admit i wasn't quite sure about this to begin with but i have warmed to it slightly and i think it's just simply for the fact that i really wanted a nice pretty dress that i could wear for work now my kind of work attire is quite smart but also kind of casual at the same sort of time like not uber casual but like if you think of like an office but yet kind of office casual i'm not making sense but hopefully you'll get my drift and yeah i just really really wanted a nice dress that didn't look too dressy that i could wear with like a pair of heels or something now what i'm not 100 percent sure with is that even with a pair of heels i'm like is this kind of like a going out dress or can i get away with it for actual work now I really really like it, it's got these beautiful frills on it and it's got this frill detailing at the back and on the sleeves as well it's kind of got like a mini flute so it's super super girly and pretty. I absolutely love this colour, it's such a beautiful colour to wear, I love this colour in my home. 
But yeah, I haven't quite got the gist with wearing this with a pair of heels. I can't, to me, it's still like a going out, out outfit rather than a casual kind of one that I can just wear around the office. Or if I've got like an event that I need to go to that I need to be casual and smart at the same kind of time. I really hope I'm making sense with this. I feel like I know what's going on in my brain, but I don't know. Let me know if I'm just talking absolute gobbledygook. See, so yeah, I just really, really like this. I think it's super, super pretty and it's definitely giving me all the spring kind of feels with this dress. Now next up, this was a little bit of a random number and I have to say, I got this in the sale. Um, it was just an on the whim kind of thing. Actually, I think this is going to work really, really well in spring and summer. It is probably last season, so if you've seen this before, I do apologise, but I got it for a fiver and I'm absolutely over the moon with it. It is this beautiful blue striped, oh, the label will be poking out, blue striped shirt top. Now, it's only got one side, so on one side it's got the collar and it's got this nice long sleeve right at the bottom and then on this side it's not got anything at all. And then it just comes down all the way to one side. So it's just a really, really trendy piece. A few people have mocked me and kind of said, oh, where's the other half of your shirt gone with this? But I actually really, really like it. I think it works so nice with a pair of jeans and some boots. And again, kind of transitioning into the summer kind of months, I just think this will work really, really well, particularly with my work. And even if you just wanted to go out and like go shopping at the weekend, I just think this is a really, really cool kind of top. To wear it's not casual but it's not incredibly smart it's just the in-between quite quirky and yeah for five pounds i'm absolutely over the moon with it and as we all know i do love a good stripe oh i love a bargain Ooh. oh i got a itch so for my last five items i picked these up in primark and first up i picked up this really 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 gorgeous spotty top now i just think this looks so trendy and also a little bit more pricey than what it was it was 10 pounds which i just thought was a bargain it's got this really nice neckline it is see-through but at the same time it's not when you've actually got it on it just looks it in the camera it's just got this nice loose shirt like fitted sleeves and then the bottom of it, it's kind of got this really nice front detailing. It kind of comes down into this beautiful wavy kind of like material. And it's just got a flowing kind of edge all around the bottom of it. As you all know, I really, really like a nice spotty top. I actually picked one up in River Island. I can't quite know when it was. It could have been, I think you would have seen it. It would have been in one of my hauls. And it actually hasn't lasted me that long. It's got a hole in it already, which I'm a bit disappointed about. It was like a crop toppy kind of top, but I really, really loved it. I love a good spotty piece. I used to have this spotty dress and I was obsessed with it. And yeah, I just never feel like a good spot polka dot goes out of fashion ever. Now I thought this would look really, really nice and sophisticated with a nice white pair of jeans and some sandals and a nice rose gold watch or something like that. That's what I'm gonna wear it with anyway. I've kind of just already seen that outfit in my head. So yeah, just really, really happy with that. I know I'm gonna get a lot of use out of this. This is, I had in mind more for like work casual attire. Next up, I picked up this really, really pretty floral skirt. Now they did have a fair few skirts and I just wanted to pick up the one. I was getting a little bit carried away in Primark and then it was gonna just turn itself into a massive Primark call. As you know, I go crazy when I'm in there because they've just got some really, really good pieces that you could really work with and they're so affordable that that's why I just go absolutely crazy when I go in there. But this time I refrained, so I hope you're proud of me. This, however, I couldn't let it go, particularly, as I said, the, for a transitional piece into the spring kind of months. I just think it works really, really well. And probably I would, again, like I said with some of the other pieces, wear this in the autumn as well. I really, really like the ruffles and the layering on this skirt. I just think it's so pretty. I love a good floral piece, and it really works with the offset black as well. This looks really, really nice actually with like a black blazer and a black tank top. That's what I've paired it with and I just really, really like the combo and with a pair of boots as well. My first skirt of the season and yes, I just really, really like it. It's super, super pretty. Now with this next item, I was absolutely buzzing while I saw this. It was 10 pounds and yeah, I was just so, so super excited because I've wanted a pair like this for quite some time. And you have to excuse as well the rumpledness because I've actually already worn these once and yeah, they kind of need like a little bit of an iron. But the item in question I'm talking about is this high-waisted, it's kind of like a cigarette trouser. They're quite like linen-y as well 
and they're just really really nice they fit super super well you could wear these with a nice pair of heels and a blazer or even just casual with some pe a pair of pumps and a nice casual top but I, as you know, as I said earlier, I love a stripe and I do associate a good stripe with the spring and the summer season and I just love these. I don't know if you've seen before, but I do have a pair of shorts that are fairly, fairly similar to these that I got from Bershka last year and I know that I'm going to be getting those bad boys out and wearing them to high heaven again this season. But to go with it, I've got these lovely, lovely, lovely trousers and for £10, this has got to be my bargain of the whole entire haul because I just absolutely love them. Stripes I don't think are going to be dying out anytime soon and I have to say I don't know what I would do without a stripe now in my wardrobe. They're just an absolute staple. Now next up I haven't actually worn this top yet but I'm really excited to and it is this beautiful white flowy top. Now when I was in when I was actually trying it on in store I wasn't actually too keen about the shoulders and the way it sat around the neck i wish it was a little bit more flowy and just a little bit more fitted but beggars can't be choosers so i haven't actually seen another one of these that fitted me even better again this was a bargain this was this was a tenner again so i mean come on just can't go wrong it's got this really nice tie up at the front and then at the sleeves yet again it's got this really really beautiful flowy flute sleeve so just really really nice i think this will go really really nicely with the pair of jeans i showed you earlier and a nice strappy heel again that would look so nice like on a day out an evening out casual or smart and yeah, I just think the colour, it totally suits the season. If you're a blonde out there, I don't know about you, but I just love the, all the, light, the lighter colours. They just really, really suit me better. So yeah, I'm excited to get a lot of use out of this one as well. So last but not least, we have come to the last item and the most cheapest of the whole entire haul. This was £4 and yet again, it's a stripe. And yet again, it's a really pretty kind of blue colour, cornflower blue, but I just thought this was the ultimate colours for spring and summer and I couldn't resist it. I have a lot of tops in this style. It's this really, really floaty style. It will go with absolutely anything. You can dress it down for casual daytime or you can dress it up for the evening. I really like the detailing of this crisscross pattern at the back. And this was £4. You cannot go wrong for £4. So yeah, another absolute bargain. So there you go, guys. That was everything that I had to show you in this haul and try on video. I really hope you enjoyed it. Do let me know what your favourite item or piece was from this whole entire haul. And also, if you would like to see a few more hauls and spring content from me. As always, I really hope you're all well and that you're all enjoying March this month. And that you're all super excited for the rest of spring in April and Easter as well. As ever, as much love as humanly possible I'm throwing out to you right now and some hugs. Lots of love and I will catch you all next time with my next video. See you later everyone. Bye!